The meeting between President Muhammad Buhari and the state governors held just two hours after President Buhari inaugurated the National Minimum Wage Committee with the aim of reviewing the existing wage structure in the country. When the president arrived at the hall, journalists were told to leave as the meeting was built to hold behind closed doors. Speaking after the meeting, Imo State Governor Mr. Rochas Okorocha said the directive of the president was to enable workers have a memorable U-tide. The president himself uh, had expressed the need to make sure that every Nigerian, especially the workers, have uh, a beautiful Christmas. And um, the issues of um, the outstanding uh, Paris Club was discussed. And that was taken care of to make sure that uh, the workers on the uh, workers in the various states of everywhere in the country gets uh, to celebrate the Christmas. Although the governors did not reveal the actual amount expected, Kaduna State Governor Malam Nasir Ahmed El Rufai says they are confident that the funds will go a long way in cushioning the impact of the economic challenges facing state governments. Every state has a specific amount that was deducted. That amount may be enough to cover the areas, it may not be, okay. okay? Because you cannot get more than what you are entitled. So it depends on state to state. My state has no salary areas at all, okay? So it's, it's a mute issue. Kano doesn't have any salary areas, it's a mute issue. Whatever we're getting, we'll just continue our development projects. Some states have salary areas well, uh, uh, bigger than what they are getting as Paris Club reports. So even when they get it, they will not be able to clear all the areas. The second tranche of the Paris Club refund to the states and the FCT was paid in July this year. So far, 760 billion naira has been released by the Ministry of Finance from the fund. This directive and eventual release of the funds, according to economic analysts, can end the era of non-payment of workers' salaries by state government if the governors do not tamper with or divert the funds. Ikharo Atta, ITV News, Abuja.